Okay, let's see if this is working. Oh shoot, I closed my browser. Hang on a sec. I guess I should have checked this before I started streaming. Please let me still be logged in. Dang it. I am not logged into Twitch. Hold on. I have two factors, so I have to go and get a code. Remember me. I wasn't just saying that for nothing. There's a song that goes like that. I'm in d -d 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 danger, Pinocchio. Remember me. Ow. Okay, now I'm being too obnoxious. Ah. I don't have the sound alerts correct. Oh well, sound alerts are not working, FYI. But it looks like the sound is working. <clears throat> Let me get the lighting better. Oh, don't fall off. Let's see if that helps. Let's see if this helps. Yeah, so I haven't done a miniature stream in a long time, so this is all like wonky. I guess I don't need my headphones in since there are no sound alerts. Sound alerts are broken. What was I even doing? Does anyone remember? I think I was making these thingies. Where's my camera? these thingies and I was trying to twist coil those up around the top that one looks all right that one's terrible I just did my nails I'm gonna mess them all up oh well okay let's see what I can do here. I think I need to move my camera. Let's change the temperature. Yellow better. Maybe like that. Which one did I just go to? This one. Feels what? Needs glue around the other side too. I wonder if I tape that down, if that will help. I just wonder if like, if I tape it down, will it just pull up? when I take the tape off. I'll try that. Let's get some more pieces of tape. some glue in here. <clears throat> and just a little on this one. This is the one where when I was doing it, it was making my, like the, the black paint.
paint on the bead was pulling up. Now oh, that yellow looks really bad. Hold on. Okay, back to blue. The black paint on the bead was getting on everything, including the the labels on the front. See, it's like a It's like gunky on there. Okay, move this aside. Did I already put glue? I did. Okay, let's see if this works. Get down there. Alright, I'm just going to put those aside for now. I can't tell, like, even where that... It just shows it. Was there something I made that that would go on? I don't think so. Oh, the tape peeled up. Okay, Let, the next thing we're going to do is make a little flower pot, it looks like. They had me cut this thing out. I don't know where this goes. I thought they had me cut that out. Oh, here it is. That's this here. Did they make me get some string? I don't see any. I was scooting stuff all over here though. Like I was wrapping presents on this table and so everything got shoved all over the place. So it could be here and I've just misplaced it. Okay, well let's see. We need G5. Here's the G box. G5 is the green paper, which is that. We need F items now. So how big of a piece do I need? Cut G5 into leave shapes, one to two centimeters, or insert them as shown. Okay, that's the only way it says to cut it. Oh wait, G10 for that little sign is in here. G10. It's one of the silver wires, but I don't know if it's the thicker or the thinner silver wire. Hey Faithful, how you doing? Thanks. Thanks for tabbing me. Wish you could stick around and talk, but I understand. So G11 is the thicker one. G10, I think is the thinner one. So that's this one, it's really thin. and it went away. Um, okay. Now I'm going to be sniffly. Now we need the F box, which is here. We need F1, which is a little flower stem. Looks like we need both of them. Oh, this one's... I don't think that's supposed to be connected like that. <laughs> this... Oh, this looks like crap. Oh, well. That's what we've got. And we need... F14. Oh. Teeny tiny flower pots. Two of them. Everything back in here. I got confused for a second. I couldn't remember what I needed the wire for. Okay, let's cut this out. It's 
So I have this little, this is A08-14. It's like a sake sign. Please focus. There it is. A08-14. It's like a foldable two-sided sign. So we'll cut that out. like so oh crap I just threw that wire on the floor there it is going the recycling here I am okay the wire it says to cut eight centimeters of this wire Let's get our ruler and our wire cutters. Okay, eight centimeters. That is not very long. Eight centimeters. Is that right? Eight centimeters. So that's only to there. That's not even enough to go. I don't think that's correct. All right, let me fold this in half first. Crimp it there. So in the picture, It says to, to put it like that through the sign and then twist it up. I'm wondering if I'm just not reading my ruler correctly. Where's my other rulers? Yeah. Okay, so maybe I'm reading it like millimeters. Eight. Eight centimeters would be up here. Maybe. Ah, that seems that seems feasible. Okay, I was reading my ruler incorrectly. Okay, let's put that back in the F box before I lose it. There must be a delivery. The dogs are barking. Next door. Okay. And then this goes up through the sign. Flatly. And then... And then comes up and connects and twists. Hmm. I'll try and fold this in half to get it more even. Be a delivery box. 
Okay, and I'm going to put a dab of glue in here for this. And pull back over. And then just twist. Oops, hit the camera. I think I need some tweezers. Not tweezers, some pliers. There we go. There's that little sign. Set that away. This is covered in threads of glue. Well, that didn't work. I'm trying to tape down the, the stuff did not work. Okay, so for these two, I need to pry this apart because this is not supposed to be stuck together. It says to cut them. One of them looks really bad. Let's cut them with these scissors. And then this, one to two centimeters. So let's do like a little thin strip like that. It's all going into this pot. And it looks like they crinkled it. Maybe I need the tips to be. Pointed. Okay, so I pointed those tips. And then let's. So I'm wadding it up to try and crinkle it a little. Well, that didn't work very well. Maybe I can, let's do this, let's, let's make the other tip pointed also. Let's fold it in half and see if I can wedge that down in there. And I'm going to put some glue down in the pot here. And then I'm going to try and put some flowers down in and maybe some leaves and maybe more flowers. I can pick them up. I think I need to cut those shorter. It's sticking down through the bottom. Okay, let's cut some of these shorter. Ooh. It shows a lot of leaves in there, and I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. This is really... Let's 
really smooth. And I cut it a little smaller. The thread from that didn't want to come off my fingers. There we go. Let's see if I can get some of this stuff out of the way. Okay. Now let's try and make these pointed also. more glue maybe I think I'm gonna need to shove it with a paper clip which I happen to have right here okay so there's leaves Huh. Alright, let's see if I can... Make them shorter. Uh, that might do. It's all sticking out the bottom though. See if I can flatten that. Okay. Get a couple more leaves. Make them pointy. Close enough. Let's put some more glue into this one. Oops, I put a lot. Yikes. Okay. And, oh goodness, it's coming out the bottom. Let's see if we can push, push some leaves down in there. parts down in there. Oh, those don't want to go at all. <laughs> I think I put those down in first last time and that was probably the way to do it. Everything is sticking to my fingers. one down in there. Well, it does not want to go. 
And I'm just going to load it up with some glue and see if it'll stay. I need to move this camera again. Alright, good enough. Get that off my fingers. Can I move the camera? Velcro. It's good. I didn't end up using the small one. I'm just using the big one. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay. So there's that. Sort of. Those don't look very good. Maybe once they glue better, I can like poke at them, cut the leaves down if necessary. We'll just call that done for now. Okay, so that's that. And we still have some of this G5, so I'm going to put it back in the box in case we actually need it again. Hey, Sean, did you need something? them after my stream. Okay, so now I need G13, which looks like a rope. Like a little yellow white rope. This one, probably. That's G13. G7. One of these cloths, white cloth, yellow cloth, white cloth. Okay. Now I need some E items. E18, which looks like to be this piece of um, cylindrical wood, and then E6, which looks like it's this, and we need two of those, and there are two. Okay. And one more item, we need a printout A0818. That's this one. This piece here. some of these green pieces off of here. Okay. So.
A18 it says cover up E18 which is this with A818 and fix it above as shown. So we've got it gets wrapped around it and doesn't quite close up at the top and then we're going to put one of these discs on the bottom cover the other disc with some fabric and put it at the top and then put the rope around it is what it looks like okay so let's get some glue And there's a there's a perforation on one end and a um, like a line on the other. So I guess I'm lining it up with that. Oh, that's gluey. Okay, let me just start wrapping it. I don't know if I want some glue under there. Fingers are all gluey. Okay, let's get a little bit of glue. And try pressing it down some more. It says to put one of these discs. Try to get the paper to all be in underneath it. Okay. And then for the top. Three and a half by three centimeters is what they want me to cut this piece. Three and a half. Let's use a pencil. Three and a half. hiccups again. I keep getting the hiccups just from clearing my throat and it's driving me crazy. Okay. So about, I guess I could just cut it all the way across and then cut that flap off. So this one I can keep. This one. Like that. This is scrap, possibly. And 
glue all over my fingers. Okay. And so I'm taking this, putting some glue on it, plopping it down in the middle of the fabric. Oh, darn it. I should be doing this on the silicone pad. Here, let me move that over. Okay. And now, I'm going to get a little glue all around. And on top. And try and wrap this. I guess I shouldn't just do corners. I should try and get each part up as I go around. <laughs> I hear somebody playing with a mouse. <laughs> it's sticking to my fingers. Okay. That's close. Oh. All right, so now let's put some glue in the center of that. And try and see if I can keep that wrapped. And then plop it down in the middle and press. That looks all right. out a little bit on the edges. Tuck that in. That's not bad. Okay, and then this rope piece. Let me put this back in the G box. This fabric in case I need to use more. I'm putting both of those back in the G box. I think this rope is a G also, so I'm going to keep that. So it says eight centimeters and it's only pointing at the one at the bottom so I'm assuming I have two pieces that are eight centimeters so I'm going to go for that let's see eight centimeters is right about there That look like it'll fit yes so there's one and then another is right there okay I guess I'll just put some glue And looks like it's covering up the connection at the top and the bottom. I mean at the, yeah, you know what I mean. Hiding the, where it's connected. Okay, so there's that one. The other one looks like it's up a little ways at the bottom. <coughs> Pardon me. in my throat.
Wow, eight centimeters was actually a little much. I'm trying to keep this up from the bottom. <coughs> I apologize. I have too much glue on my fingers to attempt to get a mouse and mute myself. There we go. I mean, it's got a little glue gunk on it, but it looks pretty good. Okay, let's set that aside. Check my timer. 12 minutes. That's enough to at least get started on the next thing. Um, did I have something to put back? I did. This piece of rope back in the G. Okay, I need some stuff from the E-box now. I need a bunch of little sticks of wood. Looks like there are four longer ones. Oh, let me move these plants out of the way. And that, and that, and this. Okay, so four pieces of wood. One, two, three, four, all the same size. And then six little ones. One, oop, two, three, four, five, six. There's one more long one and three more short ones. It doesn't imply that I'm using them for something else with this. So I'm going to assume that that's later on and put it away. So here's what I'm doing. I am gluing the big long ones. Hey, Sleepy Pitch, how's it going? Thanks for coming by. So I'm gluing the big long ones in a row to make it flat. And I'm gluing the short ones in a row. Well, that doesn't, no, that's not, oh, okay. So it looks like they're like that, actually. Little risers for this thing. Let's at least get this part to put together. Let's move these out of the way. Oh, so much glue on my fingers. Oh, well, I'm about to get more. What am I worrying about? So. I'm making this, um... Well, there's that, okay, nope, that picture over there <laughs> is the finished product, and currently I'm making little small parts from it, like here's something I made previously, it's a little sushi counter, and um, some other tiny table thing with a tea set on it and we just got done making this which I'm not sure what that is yet and we made some little flower pots that the leaves are a little too big but so now it looks like I'm making some sort of tray or or a seat or yeah I'm not sure yet so let me just put these together. I've got so much glue on my fingers, it's kind of driving me crazy. Let's see. I feel like I need to order more glue. Maybe it'll surprise me and not use it all up. Okay, I put 
more there, slide this over, put more here, slide this over, thank goodness for the silicone pad. Alright, so that is one big, oh crappers, uh, now I've done it. Okay, Let's see if I can keep that to stay flat as I scoot it around. Oh, stay flat. Okay. Stay together, stay flat. <laughs> okay, so I think the way that they have the little feet. Oh, let me get some of this stuff out of the way. Messy. The little feet, it's like two together with one up on top of it, like a little pyramid. Let's see if I can get it to do that. So there's those. And then one up on top. <laughs> it just wants to stick to my fingers. Okay, so those two together, that one on top. Oh, stay. My nail wraps are freaking out too. They're like peeling up on the ends. Okay. That one seems like it's going to stay. Hi, Varric. What are you up to? Little oh, buddy boy. Okay. Now let's see if we can get two more of these together. And then one up on top. So I wonder if I should let that just dry like that and then put it together later. I feel like I should. All right, where is the other silicon pad? Here it is. I think I'm gonna just have to scoot this entire one away so it doesn't get messed up. Let's move that over there and we'll bring this one. Okay, so we need D15. Which looks to be a piece of flat wood. Ta da! D15. And I need A0820, which is this guy, this little like samurai dude. Okay, let's cut that. looks easy enough. I think I'm just applying one to the other. My lunch was really good, but man, I am still hungry. I guess it's been a while. Yeah, it's been, it's been a while. I guess it's almost dinner time at this point, so I, yeah, whatever. Okay, so just some glue. Maybe get it to the edges. Meet, meet, meet. And plop. We made a vegan beef stew with 
TVP chunks and potatoes and um, carrots and onions and celery. And it was really good. We were in the mood for that for like, like over a month. But we kept forgetting to order the TVP chunks from Amazon. We finally remembered. Focus. There he is. We'll glue on the top. I'm going to leave that until it dries better. Well, that was easy enough. Now we're going to make some lanterns. So I need some stuff from F. I need some beads with a crisscross design. Here we go. These guys. How many of those? Two. Two of those. Four red beads. Ah, these guys. We've used those before, I think. Maybe not. This is, doesn't seem open. Oh, yes, it is. It's open. Have some crinkling. It looks like I just need four of them. One, two, three, four. <laughs> and tonight I think we're having like a grape pilaf, grape leaf pilaf thingy with bulgur wheat. I forget what else is in it. Roasted carrots, maybe? Doesn't sound very exciting, but I think I remembered it being all right. We need these A828s here, these two red, red items. All right, let's cut these out. These don't look like they're printed very well. It's not just the camera. All right, how's the time? Ah, uh, 37 seconds, really? I think I might say I'm back and finish this one up. So you'll have to Wait with me a second while I tell work I am back. Okay. There's one. And there's the other. And there's the timer. Give me one second. Ow. Okay. I told them I'm back. Doesn't look like anything has really happened. So I think we'll be okay to at least finish this lantern set. Okay. So I'm taking these three, these two thingies and coiling them. Hey, you two, what are you doing? I've got cats playing at my feet. Well, that seems like a waste. I'm coiling them around these two beads. Like, why didn't they give me some non-decorative beads if you're not even going to see it? Whatever. So, some glue. Put this paper on.
We watched the the movie Don't Look Up on Netflix yesterday. I cannot stop thinking about it. I want someone else to tell me they saw it so we can talk about it. I guess I should ask in the discords. <laughs> Who else saw this movie? Who wants to talk about it? Okay. There's that. Sticky. Maybe I put it on the paper instead. Okay. What is buzzing? Not work. That's good. Okay, so that's on there like that, and then these red beads, they don't even look like they're going to fit over those holes. I guess I need more glue. Peel the paper back off. Okay, well, that's what those will look like. red cylinder with two beads on either end and this does not want to say stay stuck on there this one either All right, some glue on this end some glue on this end bead other bead and dry. Looks like I will have to reapply some glue and get this part to stick later. Okay, now that I'm covered with glue, that's it. We're done for today. So, thank you for watching and things we have to look forward to. A vase with some little spriggy parts and um, coiling something up into a basket and putting some beads in it. Uh-oh, electrical. We're going to put a light together for a shop sign. That'll be a mess. So come see me mess it up later. Thanks for watching. See you later. Let's see who we can raid. We can raid. Let's raid Charmenti. She's playing Stardew Valley. All right, we've got a couple seconds here.